I was out running an errand for the shop when I drove past the Space Lander. I know a little something about bikes, and this is one of the coolest ever. I never seen one in person, so I figured I would pull up to the driveway and at least see if the dude was friendly. Hey, how you doing? All right. I was driving by, I seen that pretty cool bike. Is that a Space Lander? <laughs> yeah. Dude, that thing's sweet. Mind if I come over and look at it? I decided to take my 1959 boat and space out of the garage and get her cleaned up. Everybody always wants to know about the bike because they've never seen one like it. There's probably only one in the state of Nevada. They've seen one when I was in France at a museum over there. I really got excited to see it, which kind of put a damper in my honeymoon. That's why I was there. So I was more excited about the bike than I was the honeymoon. But that's whatever. I got it for Christmas in 1960. I'm the original owner. Dang. Well, the guy that designed this thing was an engineer in a Tucker automobile. He designed this thing, made like 80 of them, put them around bicycle shops throughout the United States and Europe, hoping people would place mass orders on them, like Schwinn. Nobody ordered them. So those that were in the bicycle shops, if they couldn't sell them, they, they scrapped them. There's only a handful known to exist in private collectors, the rest are in museums. Wow. So is this thing for sale? Well, I haven't thought about it because I own it all my life. Like I said, I got it for Christmas when I was like 10. It'd be hard to part with because I wanted to pass it on to the grandkids. But I got a legal issue coming up and I need some cash. Well, dude, I work at a pawn shop. We buy and sell things for a living. How much are you trying to sell it for? 20,000. Ooh wee. Would you be willing to take 7,000 for it? Oh, oh. That's cash money, man. You want to go up to 12? If you can go 85, it's a deal. Uh, let me think, let me think, let me think. 85 is a good lawyer. There you go. Make it 9,000, we got a deal. 87, and I can do it, man. I need the money. Case is coming up. All right, 8,700. I don't know how Rick's going to react at my $8,700 crap shoot, but there's one in the Smithsonian. It's got to be worth some money. I just killed it on this deal, dude. Deal of the day, deal of the week, deal of the month. And what is that? I bought one of them Space Lander bike things. A Space Lander? A yeah. real Space Lander? Yeah, the dude wanted $20,000 for it. But I talked him all the way down to $8,700. Whoa, 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 you're not allowed to spend that kind of money. Dude, it's a Space Lander. Tell him, Rick. It's a real Space Lander bicycle? Real Space Lander. Great condition, and it's all original. Thing's been sitting in the dude's garage for 20 years. So it's never been painted, nothing, original paint? Original paint, yeah. OK. A really clean Space Lander for 8700 is a good deal. I mean, they go from like twelve dollars to $20,000. Somewhere, keep it up. Before long, you'll be making more minimum wage. Everybody in here gets above minimum wage, Dad. Why? Because if you want good employees, you have to pay for good employees. Look, this is such a fun place to work. People want to pay us to be here. <laughs> hey, chum. Hey, what's up? Oh, nothing. Except for this. Chum's been doing a great job lately. He bought a Space Lander bike for less than 9000 and sometimes those things can go as high as 20000 I kind of like this side of Chum. So I'm trying to encourage him, and I'm going to give him a bonus. This is 1000 bucks. What? Yeah, 10 hundreds in here. I, I keep counting them. Dude, thanks. Dad, he did great on buying that Space Lander bike. A thousand dollars? You know what? It's the first bonus he's ever gotten. He's worked here ten years, and he works hard. All right? For the thousand dollars? In my day, a bonus meant you could still stand after a hard day's work. Dude, I'm gonna get a gold grill with this. A gold grill? You can't cook hamburgers on a gold grill. Like gold teeth that hangs in my teeth to look cool. Maybe a couple of BBS diamonds on it or something like that. You might want to consider something else. Somebody invest the money. Why don't you buy, uh, like, two shares of Apple or something instead? Or one share of Google. Invest my money, gold teeth. Invest my money, gold teeth. 
Invest my money. Gold teeth is way up here. Invest my money is way down here. Gold grill, here I come. But first, I got lunch to go to. I swear, if idiots could fly, this place would be an airport. 